What is up guys, it's Kevin back again with a quick video just letting you guys know what I've been doing and what I've been working on now. As you can see, I'm out here with Susan. I've actually been looking forward to uh, getting back around to this car and getting the parts and getting everything put on it. Now, today's objective is going to be to put the trunk lid on, the rear tail lights, the, the rear bumper, side skirts, and front bumper. Now, I know that everything is probably going to look like crap in the beginning because I've got to get the fitment right on everything because of the Bondo and all the adjustments that they made to, to actually mold the uh, body kit to the car, which I'm not going to do. So I'm going to have to go over somebody else's work to get everything right. But the first step to that is putting everything on the car and then adjusting it. So let me show you parts that I have as of now. I'm probably going to need some other parts. I'm not really sure yet, but uh, I got all this stuff on a really good deal. So let me show you what I got. All right, so here's all the parts that I have. I have the tail lights, the trunk lid, and the rear bumper. Now, one problem that we're gonna have over on this side is this bumper is still here. So, because it's molded to the car, I'll show you on the other side here in a second, I'm gonna have to cut this, uh, all the Bondo that they have stuck to it, and try to get it somewhat right without having to go back over it too much. So, if you see on this side, Right here is where the bumper is gonna sit. And all this is some shit that, you know, somebody else did. Um, another thing I wanna show you guys that I found out about this car, you know, I've probably seen it a hundred times, but I didn't really notice it. And it's kind of, kind of janky. All right, so let me show you the bad part about molding and stuff like that. Now, of course, the front bumper is off of it, sitting over there, <clears throat> but if you see this right here, that's the front bumper. That is the problem with molding this stuff because the bumper is gonna connect to the car over on this side, which was molded here, and it was molded here. So when you mold your body kit, and for whatever reason, you have to, you get in a fender bender, you have to just change the bumper, you know, whatever, it's actually molded and painted to the car. So you can't do something as simple as taking the front bumper off without having to break it and fuck all the body work that was done. So as you can see, this right here is the car. This right here is the bumper completely molded to it. I never understood why people would do that. Uh, you know, it's kind of like that instant gratification thing. It's like you do it and it looks great, but then a little bit down the road, you start to think, oh, shit, why the fuck did I do that for? So, yeah, let's see what we can get done to this thing. Alright guys, 
guys, that's pretty much it for today. That's all the time that I have. I got to get home, um, get something to eat, take a shower. I have Bondo dust all over me. Now, I still got to jump back to the Civic in a couple days and put the transmission in, uh, which that only take a few hours, but I want to try to get that done uh, before next weekend. Uh, I'm going to have to talk to the owner about the, um, about the paint. Uh, I really don't have time to do it, but, you know, it, it's kind of up to them. Now, the next video is probably going to be on this one. I want to make at least a part one on installing the turbo kit. And uh, that's going to be a step-by-step, uh, -step, you know, process of showing you guys how to do it, what I do. And, um, you know, try to teach somebody something if they want to learn how to do that. It's really not as difficult as some might think. But, guys, if you like these videos, please subscribe to the channel. Hit a like um, down below. Leave a comment. It definitely helps with the algorithm and other people being able to see my videos. So, that's it for today. I really appreciate you guys being here, and I will talk to you later.